Three by three. This is Garden of Despair by My Holden. Okay, 107 enemies. Not too little, definitely not too little. I like the this thing, the decorations. But we're already seeing most of the flats. And most of the textures, all of the textures. I know most of the flats, well, two of the flats, two out of three. This is Garden of Despair by my old and right. This is a shooting, that's fun. Yeah, I like it when, that's some piece of video game design that brings us back to the times of Nintendo. You lock a player in a room with nothing but the one thing they need to learn that how it works they have to use it. Also, a lot of 3x3 maps have to deal with the situation of not having switches. Some people have like little sectors that rise up and are like push over buttons. Other sectors, other levels I remember, Nebula Swamp had like little holes here where you could just do that. Also, if you are careful, you can use the the red, I don't remember what their names, but the red school sign and stuff like that for Okay, so that's the third flat sludge. Um, okay, the map isn't very big. The map isn't very big, and most of it appears to be this sludge area. Can I? Oh, if I was in PR boom, I probably could. Hi, please excuse me while I grab this. Nobody reacted to me firing a shot. Right. Um, oh what? That way? I guess that way. This is a very interesting looking map, especially aesthetically. Like, what the hell's that? Oh, uh, wait, does this not hurt? Okay, that's interesting, that's interesting. You probably would have, could have had this in the starting room as well, so that players could get used to the idea of this thing, which always, always, always hurts not hurting. It's cool that it doesn't, it's cool that you chose this instead of water, because this is a cool texture in its own. But maybe you could have been more clear about the fact that we can survive this. There's this thing. What does this thing do? Okay! Revy boys! Oh, come on. Not ideal, not ideal. Oh, come on. All right, um, health, soul sphere, skip, one, two, three, oh come on, All right, oh there's another guy, ow, ow, Come on, how much health do you two assholes have? Thank you very much. Right, so that was quite an encounter. This is appears this is shaping up to be one of the harder levels. It's also shaping up to be son of a bachelor. How about? Yeah, you do that. Attaboy. This is very similar to my pick of enemies. Revenants and Archviles. Not a common, not a common counter pick, but they work very well together, because revenants are have a low health pool overall, but archviles really compensate for that, and they're both very high firepower enemies that are very hard to avoid. Um, should have grabbed that first, probably. Um, thank you very much. Secret, death. Secret. Nice. Rockets. How many secrets? Five? Four. That's still a big amount of, rock of secrets. I like my secrets. I like my maps having plentiful secrets. That's one thing I like. Right, what's this? This is this is where I... Nope. This isn't where I started. Where did I start? I started... I have no idea. I have no idea where I started. I must have started somewhere over there. Yeah. So now what? Um... We need all three keys to activate this object. Cool. We can see the end of the level. Right. 
Right, cool, cool, cool. How are we on time? Just out of curiosity. Five minutes, okay. Um, it's, it's a square. Yep, it's a square. You probably want to eliminate some of these in the map editor. Some of these lines here, like this line here, and this line here, and this line here, because they, they are ceiling lines, and that's why they show in the map they make everything unclear like this is a square and it's unclear that it's a square also some of these areas if they're supposed to be walls maybe they could be a bit clearer on that like yeah um what now there was a place i didn't go yet what the hell's up with this thing um hi Come on, man! You should have been there. Uh, what you gonna do? Okay. Okay, this is ominous. Now, this is what I call a garden of despair. Not that many enemies, though. Now, it doesn't mean that I'm surviving, but not that many enemies. Some cells for your boy. Oh, let me through. Let me hit. Let me hit. What else? Is there one left? Nope. Right, so every little room is like a little revenant slaughter with a new weapon. At least that's the pattern so far. Don't want to shoot that thing just yet. Thank you very much. Oh wait, I fell down. That means I have no other choice but to shoot that thing. Right. Hopefully... Archwells, Archwells, Archwells. Where, 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 where? One down. Oh, what the hell? Out of boy, out of boy. Out of boy. What the hell? Okay. Thank you very much. Um, where did I? I went this way. Shut this thing. I like how the cubbies close after you shut the thing. That really helps. Oh, what you're gonna do? Uh, bu -bu -bu this way. Mm, that's ominous. That is ominous. I like the lighting. How there's like even two sectors here. Um. Yeesh. Yeah, that's not exactly ideal. Sounds good enough. This turn might be big enough for all of us. Right? Wait, does this ray did this raise all of the sectors? Because if it did, then that means I can grab that. And this is now kind of buried. Maybe you wanna close this off so that there isn't players can get to see this little buried cubby um right now what we can get back nothing okay nothing i think we appear to have survived so we got two out of the three keys where's the last this place i haven't been through this place yet right so it's like a little that's so much ominous stuff happening here. At least I already know everything that can happen. Wait, does this hurt? No, okay. That's good. You don't want to be switching that things up. And this is a teleporter. Right? And the others are also teleporter. And this bring you here. Okay. Have me up, fam. Where, 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 where? Not ideal, not ideal, not ideal, not ideal, not ideal, not ideal, not ideal. Survived it somehow. 
Just spam it, just spam it. And everything will be alright. Just spam it and we took care of both arch pilots. If you're not spamming the rocket launcher, what are you even doing? Right, that was fun. A bit too easy, but fun. Three secrets left. Oh. And... Two enemies? So that means secrets don't have any enemies. Correct. A bit on the easy side, mainly because you can hide here. Maybe you can... Uh, but that's up to taste. You could put a line here on the rocket launcher so that after you grab the rocket launcher this closes. And you can hide in there. But that's up to taste. That's entirely up to taste. Let me... There are no enemies. There are no dangers. So... Let's grab both of them. And... Um, Right, three secrets left. I would like very much to know more or less where they are. Attaboy. With a candle on top. Nice. Neat. And we also know that there are no enemies here. Thank you very much. Hmm. Okay, so these two secrets were interconnected. Is this one... Oh wait, this is the starting room. Cool, 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 cool. What's the last secret? What's the last secret? Where the hell could the last secret even be? One last secret right there. Yeah, yeah. I then went ahead and searched every wall I could find trying to find the missing secret. It took me quite a bit of time and I didn't manage to find it in the end. Turns out it was behind one of the teleporters in the red key room. Yeah, this is me like five minutes later. Didn't find anything. Didn't manage to find the fourth secret. So I'm afraid I'm gonna have to... Not UV Max. But I got all the items, so I don't know what the secret was. Maybe it was like a weapon, like a BFG or something like that. I don't know. Um, yeah, that was Garden of Despair by my Olden.